for your time today. I heard you um, in your introduction in the keynote and um, also I do know a couple of the VCs at Mayfield mm -hmm. Fund, fabulous fund. Uh, you do some incredible investments. Would you like to talk to me a little bit about what your domain um, focus is and your background? Sure. Uh, so I'm a managing director at Mayfield Fund. Uh, Mayfield, this is our 44th year in business. Wow. Uh, we manage over $3 billion, primarily focused on early stage investments in IT and digital media. My background before joining Mayfield is I was a serial entrepreneur. I grew up in India, came to Stanford for my master's and PhD, did my undergrad in India at IIT Delhi. Uh, did three startups before becoming a VC. The first one was VXtreme that got acquired by Microsoft to become Windows Media in 97. Worked at Microsoft for a few years, then did my second company that went public in 2000 called iBeam Broadcasting. And then I did my third company after that, which was also acquired. Uh, as a VC, um, I don't focus on any particular sector or any geography. You'll find my investments are pretty broad. Okay. I invest in mobile, cloud, software as a service, um, big data, social. I, I invest in India, China, US and Israel. Wow. My focus is backing the best people. I, I gather that if you're so, such a broad range. I'm a people-based yeah. investor. My <laughs> belief wonderful. is uh, to make a bet on the jockey rather than the racetrack. Because I believe if you back A plus people, they'll create big companies for you. And it sounds like your experience as an entrepreneur for those three startups has been incredibly valuable as far as being aware of that, the inside dynamics and uh, what Yeah, I success. think it's been very, very helpful because being an entrepreneur is a difficult job and being a CEO is even harder. So when you have some of those perspectives, I think you can empathize more with the entrepreneurs and realize it's a marathon, it's not a sprint. Focus is key and agility in the DNA of a company is even more important because dinosaurs never survive. And then patience is very important because building companies is hard, it requires a lot of time and it's really a marathon, it's not a sprint. That's fabulous. I'm going to get a few quotes out of that. It's fabulous. Um, there's a lot of changes going on in the venture industry, uh, particularly the Jobs Act last year uh, has triggered some and there's uh, obviously uh, a lot of others and I'm wondering what you see is are the possibilities, that the opportunities that are coming for the venture industry and the changes that they're having to adapt and make and also possibly what the challenges are, like what needs to happen I guess for the industry to move forward. So I think first of all change is good. The industry is getting consolidated where the amount of money coming into the industry is going down, which is good. There's a flight to quality, so the best VCs will raise money. There's a flight to quality on the companies which are getting financed. So there's not going to be that many Me Too companies. So okay. overall, when there's scarcity of capital, yes. it's goodness. So the return should go back up. There'll be less competition for startups and the best entrepreneurs will get funded. So that's the good news. Yes. Some of the challenges the industry is facing is uh, there's been a debate on the whole tax thing regarding whether it's ordinary income or whether it's long term gains on the carry. Immigration reform is really, really important for startups and the industry is talking about it. The Jobs Act is great essentially for companies to not disclose their financials before they go out. Crowdsourcing is, crowdfunding is great because it's helping innovation. It's not competitive with VCs because now entrepreneurs who may not have big ideas or might be working on sectors which are out of fashion, they can essentially go raise capital from private sources. Yes. So overall, it's a great time to be an entrepreneur and it's a great time for the venture industry. Mm -hmm. So you don't see any potential challenges there at all with this? I think I talked landscape? about some of the challenges, right? But I think challenges are good. It keeps you nimble, it keeps you humble, and it allows you to focus. And I think the entrepreneurs and startups and employees face much more challenges than a venture capitalist does. Because well, at the end, entrepreneurs make you. You've definitely got that entrepreneurial spirit as a VC and it's been a total pleasure talking to you. Thank you so much. Yeah, it's a pleasure. Thanks a lot for having me here. Pleasure. Thank you.